Hey guys, it's Roger. Man, I'm enjoying Carmel Road. I'm doing some serious uh, exploration of Kenley, which is from TriPoint Homes. They're really a new player in the marketplace. And I'm going right now from the town home community that I've been shooting the last day or two over to a neighborhood about three or four miles away, which is also another great location of townhomes for TriPoint Homes. Now, the one I'm just leaving right here on Carmel Road is basically priced in the 600s from about 600 ish to about 710. They have some quick move homes available. Plus, they've got two single family homes going to be in the high 900s. So, the, you know, taking care of your yard, uh, you know, I mean, pretty cool. Some great uh, pluses for being there. Not just the townhomes, but also those two single family homes. So, I'm trying to keep up with the salesperson. I've never done this before. She's ahead of me. She's driving from her neighborhood over to another TriPoint neighborhood. So TriPoint, they've got like a handful of townhome communities, three really right in town, here on Carmel Road, right by the Carmel Country Club, which we're just driving by right now. And then they've got one down in the Park Road area. They've got a really great little row of restaurants down there, something to behold and then this one over here which is called Everton. Now they've got other neighborhoods around and they've got new neighborhoods opening up in the next 12 months. So they're definitely a builder to contend with. We'll have, uh, when I say that, I mean, you need to compare. And you, that's why you need a buyer agent. Cause you can go into a neighborhood like this, salesperson's real sharp, knowledgeable, caring, and you would think she's your agent. She ain't your agent, she's their agent. But she's required by North Carolina Real Estate Commission uh, rules and regs to be fair and honest to you, and she will be. But does she have your best interest at heart? Nah. And so if you team with somebody on my team, we're gonna take you, I'm gonna change lanes, changing lanes. We're gonna take you to see everything that's in your price point, everything that's in your geographical region or your school district, whatever your search criteria are, we don't care. We may show you three different builders. We may show you five different neighborhoods. And then you make the choice. What happens is it's easy to go in, look around on a Saturday, sign on the, on the registration card. Do you, do you have a realtor? No, I don't have one. And then you come back a month later, you find me, and then you say, wow, can you be my buyer agent? Well, the builder will probably say, sure, they can be your buyer agent, but you have to pay them out of your own pocket. Here's what bugs me about that. I know I'm on this rabbit trail, but what bugs me is you're already paying for us to represent you. But they're not going to allow it because you signed that doggone registration card. Or you call their online concierge. Or you, uh, you know, in whatever way, you signed up online form. And that's a shame because you deserve buyer representation. One of the lines going around my team these days is often heard by Rodney Jones, where they say, wow, you just asked a really good question, Rodney. We, as the buyers, we would have never thought to ask that question. Really good question that you would have never thought to ask. Well, having your own buyer agent helps you in that because like farmer's insurance, we know a thing or two, because we've seen a thing or two. So guys, get yourself a buyer agent before you go looking around. And that's the, that's the key, that's the cool thing. So right now we're, we're headed closer and deeper into town and we are going to Everton. Now Everton is a small townhome community. The model home, which I intend to shoot today, be on the end of this end screen. There are no more of those available, but they have some that are available that are not quite like the model, but will give you a vibe for the neighborhood and what you could ex reasonably expect and so on. So people often ask us, hey, how's the market in Charlotte now? Had an investor on the phone today. I uh, had a call from, uh, where was that call from uh, today? From uh, the, the DMV area, DC, Maryland, and Verm uh, uh, Virginia, from Upper Virginia and Washington, DC area. Hey, how's the market? If the market's anything like it is up here, it's this. And, and right, it's, you know, the market seems to be cooling a little bit. Maybe not cooling, but we're seeing signs that the, the craziness is starting to wear off. Uh, and yet the, or, the mortgage rates are seeming like they're ticking up. You know, the Fed raised rates, etc. So, 
you know, it's a balance. So the, the answer is on the day that you're ready to purchase, what's the market looking like? You know, if you have a need and you need to move, then what the market looks like today, you know, that's the deal, right? 